In this video, we're going to take a look at how to change the social media links on your website. So if you look at your website, you notice there you have social media links on the top and at the bottom of your website. So how to make the change? Very simple. So you just want to go into your dashboard uh, and then you're going to go So when you, once you log in, you're going to go to appearance widgets. And there's two places you need to look. So it is uh, before header two, and you wanna look for the social media widget. So if we drop down here, uh, we're gonna see, you don't have to worry about this stuff. And uh, if we notice here, this is how the arrangement is of the social media links on your sites. So we have Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn. If we look over here, it's Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn. Uh, we can actually drag and, you know, if we want to change the order, we can just drag and drop those. Uh, so for social networking, we can just go into here. So this would be, so where it says facebook.com, this is where you would place your Facebook business page. So facebook.com forward slash Phoenix real estate agent or whatever your business page in. And then you put all your Google plus Twitter, I don't know who's still using MySpace, but anyway, you get the idea. Uh, you got to go and grab your, you know, like for Twitter, I would have to go grab my uh, my own profile, which is twitter.com WordPress Dave. I would grab that and then I would just drop it into here, for example. And that's, that's how you do that. Uh, images and video, you know, like, you know, if you've got, uh, you know, Picasso or Flickr, your YouTube channel, that's usually mostly the one people are looking for. Uh, then, you know, if you're, if you are using Yelp, you're going to look here in business review sharing and share your Yelp URL. So anyway, pretty simple. Uh, also for the footer, it's in footer three. So you, again, you'd have to go and change, you know, those links as well. So again, the, the top widget panel for your social media icons are not linked to these ones at the bottom. So you do have to change those separately. So uh, hopefully that helps. Uh, stay tuned for more tips and tutorials from iFoundAgent. Thank you.